Jackson Art Corb wants to know if the lack of practice time with Big Ben is a game changer because of all of the drops that we've seen from the receivers. And I do want to point one thing out before you get to his question, Ike. A lot of people are making of that the Steelers are playing three games in 12 days. Well, they did that in the 2019 season. They did that in 2018, 2016, and 2015. Free so tool. this happens Free Free pretty tool. much yep. every year. Why are we freaking yep. out about this again? I understand circumstances are different with COVID, but it's just like, it says, oh, three games in 12 days. Yeah, that's, I want more time to prepare for my opponent but they've done this for the last five years, multiple times. Is it lack of practice time? Is it lack of concentration of just watching the ball all the way into your hands? Why are we seeing the high number of drops? I, I do think part of it is the play calling in terms of not relying on the run as much as you would with the traditional offense. But what do you see with that, Ike? Seven, seven been putting the ball where the receivers need to catch it. So, and, and I know seven, and if you give seven an inch, he's going to take him out. So during this COVID trace, not that he had COVID, he was around somebody who had COVID, and they call it a trace. And they won the ball game and seven only practice on Friday. No, 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 no. He practiced doing a walkthrough, so that was a Saturday. You remember when Coach T had a look? I think he spent like 15 to 20 minutes extra on that walkthrough on Saturday, and they wound up winning the ball game. I know seven, I know how you think. Well, coach, we won the ball game, and I really don't need to practice throughout the week. So from this point on, this is exactly what I'm going to do. Since you didn't give me this inch, I'm going to go ahead and stroke this mile. I only need to practice one day of the week, and that's a Friday. That's the only time I need to practice. Now, in Ben's defense, the balls he's been throwing, they've been very catchable balls, very catchable as a receiver. They've been very catchable balls. So as a receiving core, they just got to own their responsibility on catching the ball and being consistent, especially during crunch time. 